Welcome to Software to See from Festo. In this video we show you how to commission the positioner CMSH and execute an initialization. In our setup, the positioner is connected to a computer via a heart modem. On the computer and FDT framework is installed and the device description of the CMSH has already been loaded. If a connection to the device is successfully established, this will be visible in the status area of the framework. Initially, the connected device is in the delivery state. Initial startup and initialization have not yet taken place. This means that the prerequisites for automated regular operation have not yet been met. The non-initialized state is displayed in the status area of the dashboard view. In order to transfer the device into the operational state, we navigate via the folder device. To the menu guided setup. There a quick commissioning of the positioner CMSH is enabled with a few settings. The first parameter can be used to set the display language on the device. Currently English and German languages can be selected. In a second step, the activator type can be set. A distinction is made between linear and rotary drives. For linear drives with level kinematics, a scene correction can also be activated. The third parameter allows changing the operating direction of the activator. It specifies which position is displayed when nomadic outputs 2 is completely rendered 0 or 100%. With the fourth parameter function of extension modules can be activated. Currently only the option volume booster is offered here. In the next step, the tight clothes can be configured. This determines whether, and if so, at which end positions the tied closing is to be activated. In addition that I close values can be defined. The lower limit specifies the value below which the setpoint position must fall for the activator to move to the lower end position with full force. As the second to last commissioning step to control mode can be selected. In robust mode control is rather slow but precise. In fast mode, the target position should be reached in the shortest possible time. Overshoot is accepted in this case. Control according to self-selected coefficients is also possible. At the end of the setup procedure initialization routine must be triggered. To routine is called up secured by a dialog. After confirming the query, a three-step process starts on the connected device. In the first step, the position sensing is taught. Then the end positions, travel velocities and finally the control parameters are determined. This process can take a few moments. To process progress can be monitored via to status field. The device has been initialized successfully. However, the other settings made will not take effect in the device until the changes are written to the device via the apply button. Successful commissioning is now also visible in the dashboard. In the status displays. The guided setup menu is only a simple access to the essential steps of a typical commissioning. All settings shown. But of course all the further configurations can also be made via the settings menu. For example, it is possible to configure the digital inputs. Or to change the dead band. 
The initialization routine can also be called via a separate menu area. If you like this video please subscribe to our channel and keep yourself informed. See you next time.